Hello, hello, how are you doing? Another very quick video today. This one's more about party management. Um, so depending on your party size, the length and complexity of your campaign, you may lack a way of quickly seeing all your party's information at once. I know a lot of DMs that still use either Foundry or Roll20, but they go and keep a spreadsheet or a print off or a notebook of the main statistics of their party. There's one called Party Tracker. Um, what this will let you do is when you have it enabled on your Actors tab, you will have a new button, Party Overview. When you click on it, it will summarize all the PCs who are on that scene. Um, so that can cause problems if you're splitting people between two different floors or if one of your players is missing that week. So it's handy, this works well with like a landing page you might have or a dungeon crawl that all the group are going through. When we look at what it shows, it shows our party members, an indicator for if anybody currently has inspiration, what the current HP is, AC, passive perception, passive investigation, passive insight, and passive stealth is. So you can just, at a glance, if you want to know, especially if people are moving from room to room and there's hidden details, instead of constantly going, what's everyone's passive perception? Or clicking through each character sheet to see it, or having to make a note, and maybe the jotted note you're referring to is out of date since they leveled up, you can just click this and see it at any point. You can also click languages and get a full breakdown of who speaks what languages. Um, what the language cover is from the party. That can be handy if you've you know, some puzzles or social encounters. And you know, the elemental speaks a language that, oh, one second, click. Uh, yeah, only Halvor you understand. Things like that. It's very handy for wealth. That can be more useful for you as a DM, saving time because you know, the expensive magical item is 7,500 gold and your players start going, uh, well, I've got 138, uh, she's got 3,500, that comes to... Uh, you can just open this up. And I find a lot of players and DMs struggle with converting up or down the multiples of copper to silver to gold to platinum. Um, so this at least, and even Electrum if you do use it in your game, this gives a total gold summary. So at any time, looking across your player's inventories, and obviously this doesn't include items that might say, you know, gems worth 500 gold. This is looking at the gold that is typed, that is entered into their currency boxes. But you can look at this and go, here's what everyone's got. And the party as a total have a total of 4,657 gold. Just like that. I find it really useful. Background, my group don't have their backgrounds in here, mainly because we started um, in Fantasy Grounds about two years ago, and the characters were all established and have evolved and have grown to a point where it's not really felt necessary since our transfer to Foundry to type all that out. The players are very organic now. Um, that's all there is to Party Overview. Like I said, a really simple, straightforward module that I think can give you a lot of help and some really good tools for keeping an eye on the information in your party you might want to have a quick reference to on the fly, during or in between sessions. As ever, leave me a comment, let me know what you liked, what you didn't, any modules you want me to cover in the future, but otherwise, thank you very much and take care.